7 Small Terraced House Living Room Ideas Decorating a small room is not always a straightforward task, and there may be some challenges to overcome. However, if you are clever about the color scheme, furnishings, and decor that you choose, you can create a warm and inviting terraced house living room that offers the illusion of extra space. 1. Use your walls to minimize clutter. Hanging decorations, which double as storage solutions, are a great way to keep your small living room feeling spacious, airy, and uncluttered. Hanging small knitted baskets on the wall or a cloth storage tower from the ceiling are both decorative and practical options to store small loose items, such as children's toys and small games. This will ultimately keep your living room looking tidy and less cluttered. Two, make the most of mirrors. When you are dealing with a small living room design, carefully placing wall mirrors in the correct place will help you to make the most your space by creating the illusion of extra depth, width, and height. This may be one of the oldest interior design ideas in the book, but it is also one of the most effective and why it is still often used by professional interior designers. If you can, choose an extra large mirror that takes up most of the free wall space and make sure that it is situated to catch and reflect as much of the natural light as possible. Three, choose furnishings with exposed or narrow legs. Furniture with thin spindly legs and exposed sides creates the illusion of space by allowing us to see through and beyond them. In short, when you have a traditional coffee table or bookcase, the area that they use to function is taken from the room, but so too is all the space that they cover. When you choose an open, thin frame bookcase or coffee table, you can still see the walls beyond and the floor underneath them. While this makes no practical or functional difference, it does give the impression of more openness. Four, Try mirrored or glass furniture. As you may be beginning to gather, the furnishings you choose for a smaller room are very important. Just as thin-legged furniture creates the illusion of space, glass-topped furniture can do the same. Adding mirrored furniture creates interesting optical illusions and brightens the overall feel of the room. This happens as they reflect and refract the natural light. A common design challenge is balancing design with practicality. And the downside in this case is that glass and mirrored furnishings require far more upkeep. They will need to be polished and dusted regularly to remove fingerprints and other marks. Otherwise, they will simply draw attention to themselves and away from your room, which is not what you are trying to achieve. 5. Add some greenery. This advice may seem to go against tradition, but there are always exceptions which prove the rule. With interior design, plants, more often than not, are this exception. Studies have shown that having plants in a room not only elevates your mood, but is also good for your health and well-being. Putting scented plants on a windowsill, for example, will fill the room with a pleasant natural scent, especially with a breeze from an open window. Plants are also a good way to fill negative space. Negative space is any space which cannot be easily utilized for anything other purpose. A good example of negative space is a non-functioning fireplace, for instance. 6. Take advantage of high ceilings. Some rooms, although small, have the benefit of having high ceilings. If your living room is one of these, you should make the most of it. You certainly couldn't get away with this colorful, busy, and detailed wallpaper without them. Tall storage units, shelving units, and light fittings, which reflect and refract light, should also be high on your list of must-haves. Anything which draws the eye up and saves on floor space is instrumental in maximizing space in any small room. You could even add extra greenery to your living room by having hanging plants dangling from the ceiling. Seven, make use of architectural anomalies. Indentations, protrusions, and strange shapes are very much a feature in small homes, especially in period properties, and they can make decorating a real nightmare unless you use them to your advantage. If you have a sizable alcove, try putting furniture such as sideboards and sofas into that area to save floor space. Or you can use the alcove to create your very own home office space. Bay windows, in particular, can be a gift for small spaces. Placing a chair or small sofa into it or investing in a bespoke box seat with storage will save a lot of space within the main floor area and give the illusion of having more space. Decorate your room in a way that pleases you and makes you happy. After all,
this is your living space, no one else's. If you prefer solid wooden furniture, choose that. If you would rather have an oversized sofa, have one. These ideas are just ideas. You can always offset any pieces or choices that make the room feel small with other alterations discussed. To read all 24 small terraced house living room ideas, please click the link in the description.